Hey right guys, this is Joe here and today I'm going to be showing you how you can add more RAM to your Minecraft server, what is vanilla. So yeah, let's get started. So first of all, you want to make a folder on your desktop and just call it, you know, um, you can just call it server, I'm just going to put version, so it's 1.7 at the moment. This should work with every single version above and a few below if you want it to. I don't know why you want to go below, but anyway, never mind. So now you've made your folder, you want to go to your search engine, then search minecraft.net, link is down in the description, then click come, on over, come over here and click download here. Right, now you want to, as you see here, it just says multiplayer servers, don't bother clicking on uh, minecraft underscore server dot whatever version dot exe, don't bother downloading, download one with a jar file, so you want to just download that click that and that will take a few seconds sorry for that little cut I don't know what happened I had to close my chrome and uh, yes yeah. so anyway now it's downloaded so you've just clicked on that and it should just download into a jar file now you want to come to your desktop drop it into your 1.7 server file like this and let's stick that like that so once you've done that you need to do uh, right click go down to new you need to get a text document and just call it you want to call it run just like that. double click it right, I am using notepad plus plus but you'll probably use just a normal notepad so now we want to go back to the minecraft page and from here to all the way up to Java you need to copy all of that so yeah just control C it so from end of this sentence all the way up to Java now make sure you copy all that or it will not work and then you need to paste that in just like that so yeah so it will not run at the moment so we need to do file save as then we need to go all files remember to do that then this is what you got to get dot bat bat save it and now you're done so delete that old one but we still haven't really done it because in the code at the moment as you can see it says R, R1 says minecraft underscore server dot whatever version you're in at here it just says uh, minecraft underscore server so what we need to do I would recommend you just keep that the same and change that like that it already knows it's a jar file by here so you just knock off the end numbers and not make sure you knock off the just the single dot then we want to run the server just like that let it load up right then I, in my last video of 1.8 video you gotta you gotta confirm a EULA now it's it's what they want you to do where you it's like uh, when you sign up to a website like terms conditions and all that so that's what they want to do you will need to go and uh, you need to go and you know, I recommend because this can you know if you do it wrong they will delete your Minecraft account or get lawyers involved if you go against this EULA so you want to just come to Minecraft put that link in just like that that's this one here it's in the text file already so let's just expand that so you can see everything so you want to just come over to that go through this I really recommend you need to read it you know it tells all the terms and services and what they're changing and all that so yeah so once you've done that we can just exit out of that and read it so then you want to just go back into this folder I'm just gonna go notepad then you want to just turn it to true ah, that did not save all right true save yes then run your server do again so once you've done that tree, it'll start generating the things so yeah, you, you do get two windows that's the downside about everything so here you go you know done and it tells you how many seconds it depends on your computer speed because I'm I am running this server on an SSD so it does load quite fast so yeah, when you are initially loading it can take a lot you know quite a long time but you, nothing you can do about it so yeah what I recommend now is to do stop you can do stop in there or then it stops both server both server con consoles and yeah 
So now we want to just uh, look into the server config. Oop. Right, let's just edit with Notepad plus plus. Right, there we go. So yeah, this is where you can uh, set all your you know things and all that. Set your server message. So uh, I won't actually bother changing it, but you know you can, you can do a lot of stuff in here. So anyway, let's run it. Let it just run up, and as soon as you run it once, it should run much quicker. So yeah, so let's show you how you can actually add the RAM now. So we're gonna just stop it for the final time. Then you want to come over to the room file, edit it. So yeah, you can just go on Google. So we can go to uh, gigabytes to uh, megabytes, as you can see here. Yes, converter. So let let's say you want to add three um, three megabytes. So if you don't know how, the actual number, you can just go to this website or sometimes Google offers it. So we're just going to type in three there, convert. And you just need to grab that number, so 3072. Then you want to come over here and replace the maximum number, so that's a minimum and that's a maximum. Then we want to go to just save it, exit, exit it, and now run it. So as you see here, it's running with 3 gig and minimum 1 gig. So yeah, or you can set both of them to 3 gig, so it's just the max. So yeah, it depends how much RAM. You will you won't be able to do this on a 32-bit computer if you're adding RAM. So yeah, let's just uh, connect to it. Let my launcher load. Make sure I'm in the right version. Yep. Right then. So yeah, I've got you know the local host here. So you just make a new server, or you can connect by quick connect. Just down there, or direct connect. Sorry. And yeah, here we go. I'm on my server. What I've just made. So I want to just opt myself. Then I can just game mode myself. Just like that. So that's how you make a server and add more RAM to it. So yeah, thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. Please subscribe. Please like this video. And yeah, I will see you in a bit.